to face the chaser. It's Daniel. Welcome to the show, Hi, Daniel. Bradley. A greenkeeper. Yeah. Great. That's a job I always wanted. <laughs> it's fantastic if you love being outdoors. I did it for about nine years on a five-star luxury resort, and then I had a complete change of career path. I ended up going to America with two of my best friends. I worked in New Jersey for two years doing football coaching, and the time was right to come home, and I've got back into greenkeeping. I'd have loved to have been a greenkeeper. I think yeah. it's a far oh, do. I think it's a fab job. I really do. What do you do to relax? You play yourself? Football? No, I don't play golf whatsoever, Bradley. No, it's a busman's holiday, that isn't it? Yeah, of I like to get away from it. I'm football. I'm a, I'm a huge Middlesbrough fan. Yeah. Go home and away for better for worse. Me and I would go everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, fair enough. And if you were to win some money today, what would you do with it? Absolutely nothing, Flash Bradley. I'm going to bore the life out of you. I need a new bed. Man broke not so long back, so I've been waking up like Quasimodo every morning, so I'm going to get myself a new bed, it's as simple as that. <laughs> Good for you, mate. <laughs> a bed's that expensive? I no, not really, but if I, if I win a few bob, I'll get an all sing and all dancing one. It'll do the lot for me, yeah. Oh, all right, let's get you a bed, Daniel. Let's get you a real Flash Harry bed. I like it. All right, are you ready, mate? Yeah. Good luck, your time. <laughs> Starts now. The logo of space agency NASA is red, white, and what other colour? Blue. Correct. In the late 13th century, Robert the Bruce joined the revolt under which Scottish national hero? River. William Wallace. Tom Jones sang the theme tune to which 60s Bond film? Gold Knight. Thunderball. James Maxwell and Charles Tuke designed what Blackpool tourist attraction? The Blackpool Tower. Correct. The Taverners Sports Charity is named after a bar at what cricket ground? Lodge. Correct. At the end of The Taming of the Shrew, who says, kiss me, Kate? Othello. Petruchio. The name of what primate can go after Greece and before wrench? Monkey. Correct. Which Muppet character is usually shown in a pair with Statler? Pass. Waldorf. What orchestral string instrument has pedals, a pillar and pins? Ha. Correct. Martin Sheen is the father of which platoon actor? Er, uh, Charlie Sheen. Correct. True is the autobiography of which Spandau Ballet star? Uh, Martin Kemp. Correct. Oh, great answers, Dan. Terrific. Seven grand. That's all right, isn't it? Yes, great. You're kidding. Five and above I was looking for. Seven's all right, yeah. Yeah, no, seven's great, mate. What was the name of the maritime border dispute that brought Chile and Argentina to the brink of war in 1978? A, the Beagle dispute, B, the Bulldog dispute, or C, the Boxer dispute? You've put Beagle Dispute. I've gone for the Beagle Dispute, which says it's a maritime border dispute, so I'm thinking the sea, obviously, and the Beagle sounds like it could be some sort of ship, maybe, as opposed to a bulldog or a boxer. Correct answer is... Great. Uh, Darwin's ship was the Beagle, so well played. Step close to home, Chaser's put. Very good. Good logic, yeah. Here's next question. Which work includes the line the proletarians have nothing to lose but their chains. A, Mein Kampf. B, the Communist Manifesto. C, Rights of Man. You've put Communist Manifesto. The proletarians, the proletarians shot the pros, isn't it? The, the yeah. average, yeah. no good, nobody's communists. Do they rule over people a bit like that? Correct answer is. Well played, step close to home. Chaser's put. Goes right, also. Yeah, published in 1848, written by Karl Marx and Frederick Engels, and it completes a quote, the proletarians have nothing to lose but they change, they have the world to win. Thank you. Here's your next question. Which of these is not an Ivy League university? A, Cornell, B, Columbia, C, Caltech. You've put... Columbia. Fairly sure Cornell is. Toss up between the other two, to be honest. I've never heard of Caltech, that's for sure, and I wonder if that's the red herring to make us think it was that. Correct answer is... Mm. Ah, yeah. Stand where you are. Caltech's the right answer. Chase has put... Yeah. There are eight Ivy League universities. They're mainly based in the uh, northeast of the United States. Thank you. Chase is now two behind with three from home. Here's the next question. How many caps did George Best win for Northern Ireland? A37, B67, C97. You've put 37. I'd have put that. Correct answer is. Yeah, we'll play. Step close to home. 37 is Chaser's put. Yeah, it goes right at 37. Yeah. 
great player. We're two from home. Here's next question. Which TV character allegedly saved the life of Field Marshal Haig at Mboto Gorge in 1892? A. Poldark, B. Blackadder, C. Poirot. You've put Blackadder. Bit of a clutch. Could he have saved him by accident somehow? Possibly. Correct answer is. Wild play. Step close home. Blackadder's right. Chaser's put. Goes also with Blackadder. Chaser remains two places behind us. We're one from home. Here we go. Former Chancellor of the Exchequer, Geoffrey Howe, had a dog called what? A. Budget. B. Taxes. C. Monetary policy. You've put budget. It's got to be. It's the most yeah name, surely, isn't it? Yeah. To go through with seven grand. Do we get through? Is Daniel my first player in the final? Correct answer is.